Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Janelle and Everly. And we have Scotchy, and he might make an appearance coming in and out. And he just walked by the camera. You can't see it because it's like, hi. But if you see a dog running around, that is Scotch. We are filming a quick video today just in my downstairs living area. And so I want to talk about my three favorite teething toys for babies. As Everly just turned five months last week, which is completely insane. And I am freaking out still at the same time because I don't understand how she's five months and I've had her for almost half a year. Like it just, I, I don't understand. Time goes by so quick. It's, it's insane. I'm sure if you're a mom, you will feel the exact same way. But I wanted to, like I said, I wanted to talk about my three favorite teether toys as there's so many out there and it's like, what do I buy? So I wanted to kind of say, yeah, you're excited. I want to talk about the three uh, top ones that she's been playing with just over the past few months or past few weeks, really more so kind of getting into them. So let's just jump right into it and I'm going to share my top three teether toys. First and foremost, I know everyone is going to talk about this, but it honestly lives up to the hype. Sophie the Giraffe. It is the greatest teether toy. Like, it's one of those things I thought it's like, hey, every baby has it, but like, legit, do they like it? Does it actually work properly? And she honestly loves it. I think it's because like the ears and then like the feet, there's so many little grooves that they can get their mouth into and around their teeth that they love it so much. And it's just like, it's easy to clean. It wipes down. It's just honestly the perfect thing. The one thing with Sophie, I will say though, is if you have a dog like this guy, um, so Sophie does make a squeaking sound like, and then when we first opened this, Scotch went completely nuts because he thought it was his toy because it squeaked. But he has slowly adjusted to that learning that like this toy is not his, it is Everly's. So if you do have a dog and they are prone to like taking anything that squeaks, this might not be the best teether toy for you because you're going to be constantly fighting with your dog not to take it or not rip it apart. And we all know baby stuff is not cheap. So you don't want to have to keep buying something over and over again. So keep that in mind if you do have a dog. But for us, like he did learn over time that this was not his. The next teether toy I'm going to talk about is this one. So this is a little pink ring that can go in the fridge. And this is really cool because you can make it, you put it in the fridge, not the freezer, because if you put it in the freezer, yes, it will be colder, but it's going to be too cold for your baby's hands. So you keep it in the fridge and then you bring it out and it's perfect for rubbing on their gums and just helps uh, ease any pain that they may have when they're teething. Double fisting for toys. There are so many different versions of this toy, which is so great because there's different shapes and sizes. So depending on what your baby likes, what's to, uh, what they like to grab onto, there's ones that have little plastic pieces as well. So there's a whole different variety of them that you can have. So just take a look on Amazon. I'll maybe link some down below for you guys in the description box if you want to take a look. But I definitely suggest something that can go in the fridge as it will totally help your baby's gums. Last but not least is this little bunny rabbit, which is a silicone and a wooden combination teeter toy. And this might be one of her favorites. She really does like Sophie the Draft, but this one I find she just really likes to hold on to like the circle aspect of it. And then because it has the bunny ears, it's just the perfect little chewing toy and like shape to like help with their gums. So it's so great for that. And I love, it just looks really pretty too, like the wood and the pastel color. So it's really cute. Um, I know that really doesn't matter, but let's be honest, us being moms, we do buy things because they are cute. So I'm not going to lie. I have done it. And this is by the brand Lollipop. And I've looked on their website because this was given to us as a gift. But they have different uh, different animals on there as well as different colors. So there's a whole variety of ones that you can pick from. But I like the bunny. It's cute, right? Once again, this one is very easy to clean. You can just take a wipe to it. I've even thrown it in our sterilizer before too. So that helped clean it off because uh, she dropped it outside one time. Thanks for watching this video. Those were my top three teether toys. As mentioned, these might not work for your baby, but those, these have just been the top three that Everly has totally loved over the past few weeks. So I thought I'd share them in case they will help your baby. And there's so many online that maybe you're just not too sure what you wanna buy. So those are our uh, three top tip, uh, tips or picks, whatever you wanna call it. 
you like those so we're just going to share it with everybody and then i want to mention as well this is a really cool one too i'm not sure if it's considered a teether toy but this is something she's played with since she was probably like as soon as she started grabbing onto things like you would hold it up and she would grab because there's so many little pieces in it like little areas to grab and whatnot so this was one of the first ones she started grabbing and playing with so if you see any of these i'll link it below i have no idea what it's called it was a, a hand-me-down for us but there's just so many spots like i said they can grab it's easy for them to chew on it's been great as well so i guess this really is top four but you know what i mean top three top four our top teether toys as always thank you so much for watching and make sure to give this video a big thumbs up subscribe to our channel as we'll be back next week with more videos thanks for watching guys bye